What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video of 7 Days to Die Alpha 18. Hope you guys are well. It is day 7 and you know what that means guys? It is Horde Night. Um, it's 7am currently game time and I've got a ton of things to do right now at the moment um, in getting our base set up. But first what I want to do is I'm just going through and getting some bullets made up. I'm going to probably try and hang back as best as I can for the minute and uh, maybe just suss out what we've got here from the trader. Um, sell a couple of things and see if we can get um, some... Uh, oh, you know what? I left my money at home. So it's really not going to equate to anything. But... Um, actually, I don't have any jobs. Actually, you know why? Because I've already got a job underway, which I haven't done yet. So, anyway. Is what it is. Managed to get some mechanical parts and things like that along the way. Um, ended up looting a few you know what i think i might just keep those polymer i think he likes the polymer no, no. um but anyway we sort of went through and i just found a couple cars and more or less just looted them up but i just wanted to get some inventory space set up i've only got about 170 dukes he's going to restock on day 10 so this actually just restocked so let's quickly see what he has and if he's got anything of interest i might just snag a few things and at least that way we can, you know, sort of move on. Copperstone rocks, wow. A thousand for that. How much? 200 dukes. Ooh, I think I might actually invest in that. If I do that, it's 5,000. Yeah, no thanks. Cement, 800 dukes, no problem. Um, yeah, that's way expensive for me to actually sort of make anything of it. Um, but it's actually got some really good clothes. Like some really good clothes, like level four, tier 4 quality, military style. Um, yeah, okay. I don't have the money for that, unfortunately. Very nice helmet, a very expensive helmet, I might add, so I'm not going to bother with that. Um, Weapon-wise, what has he got? He's got some magnum, uh, magnum ammo. Uh, armor piercing, that's quite expensive. I don't know if I'm going to go for anything like that. Um, bullet tips, I've got, I've, I've got bullet tips now. I've got access to make bullet tips, which is fine, so... That is not a problem whatsoever. Uh, where are we? So we've got this. Nothing of interest here. Gunpowder. He's got a ton of gunpowder. I've got a bit of gunpowder, so I'm not going to need that immediately right away. Um, what else do we have here? Meat. Wrench. Nice wrench, by the way. Uh, the fireman's Olman Ol Ol Mac. Olman Ol Mac. Anyway. Um, greater to hypothermial resistance. Don't have the money for that, but that's actually really good. Um, archery, you've got the Night Stalker. I'm not too worried about that. Anvil, I really like to get the Anvil, but I don't have the money for it with me here. But it is what it is, so we should yeah, I'll be come okay. Back now. Yeah, I'll, I will come back. Let's just close you up. Let's see how this is doing, because I really don't want to make two trips to come back. Um, fantastic. So at least I've got some ammo for tonight. Um, I ran out of bullet casings, so I, that's the only thing. And he didn't really have any bullet casings, which is a bit of a pain in my side. Um, let's just quickly have a look-see, because he only just had the gunpowder. There was no shells or anything like that. And I don't have any brass, so... Maybe yeah, next time. It is what it is. So survivor. we're going to quickly run back home, and um, basically I'm going to go through some of the bits and pieces that I was doing um, off-camera. So, yeah... But there's other things I wanted to sort of go through with you guys as well. And uh, during the previous night before um, Horde Day, um, I, had, I sort of started setting up my base. I threw some cobble, uh, flagstone blocks onto the base. And I was breaking out some of the edgings overnight just so I can sort of get a head start. Yeah, a horde of zombies come through and sort of destroyed what I was sort of making. So we're going to have to sort of go through that as well and get that... Um, uh, re-looked at and yeah hopefully I'll have enough resources to go ahead and get Horde Knights set up but with that being said we are still uh, just plodding along and I'm thinking about a few things just for uh, for day 14 Horde Knight I think I sort of mentioned that before in the previous video just to sort of give you guys a bit of an idea of what I'm thinking so um, I'm not going to sort of reveal too much, um, I'm actually using a concept that um, a fellow Aussie um, Seven Days That I YouTuber, uh, Ja Woodall, if you guys know who he is, he does some excellent videos um, of Seven Days To Die and um, 
yeah, he's he's awesome. So I'm using his concept um, for one of his builds, and I'm going to see how that sort of goes for myself. Hopefully, it goes well. I'm not too sure, but we'll, we'll see how that sort of you know um, pans out. But we are pretty much back home. As we said last video, we smashed through all these buildings here, and yeah, did pretty good with that. All right, so back at home, let's just jump off the the uh, bicycle. As you can see, my home base is um, a little bit worse for wear, but I'll be fixing that up eventually. Anywho, um, with that being said, so let's get rid of that. That um, that not going to need that anymore. Uh, the iron, I'll just keep there. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. And these guys here, I'm not going to need right now. Okay. So, this is pretty much what I'm going to need. Uh, dukes aside, I should actually put my dukes away. Uh, with Ooh, I'm actually really out of dukes. I'm going to have to do some um, missions and quests and things like that. Um, how did you go? Okay. Very good. Let's grab that. Um, let's craft some more. So, I'm, I'm at a race against time right now, guys. So, I am needing to get these iron spikes uh, cooked up or, you know, set up straight away as soon as possible. But, unfortunately, right now, yeah, I'm actually in a bit of a pickle. But, we should be okay. I think I might get enough as much as I can kind of thing before uh, Horde Night actually sets in. So we do have a bit of time up our sleeves. Yep, come on, get out of that. And I'm making a little clay, pot, um, clay I guess, uh, mine. But anyway, this is it. So this is what happened. So pretty much where you see most of the... Um, is that sheet? I think that is rock sheet. Uh, mine sheet, yeah. God, that's a thousand. You know what? I really don't have time for that. Anyway, so yeah, I plugged up most of what I thought I could do, but the zombies absolutely just came through and annihilated the fact. So yeah, not so good. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have to start redoing all of that. But some places they didn't actually hit, which is good. So I'm quite happy with that. But they actually did get into some of the areas and made a bit of a mess of things, like as you can see here. So... Yeah, I'm going to pretty much needing to uh, fix all this up. Got some cobblestone as well, or rocks, and just pretty much I'm going to have to start um, improving the base. I'm not too sure how I'm going to go with because I don't think I have any cement or anything like that. So, um, or enough of it just to sort of, you know, build it up. Why did I do that? Are you serious? Don't need to waste silly amounts of these things. And I need to make a quick um, exit strategy plan as well. I'm thinking maybe if I make my little um, uh, my little exit part just here. And at least that way if I have to leave I can sort of run back home I guess. But we'll see how that all pans out. But yeah as you can see look at this mess. This is absolutely crazy. Actually what I should be doing is I've got this. So where's my spikes? just realized that I needed to do this. I know it's not much, but it's six more than I would have had to have done later on. So yeah, let's get all that happening and let's get all this all sorted out. So I'm just sort of trying to push all this on. And I don't know how I'm going to do it with, um, I think I should need internal access after I've sort of plugged up this. To be honest with you, I've already got internal access, let's face it, uh, through the roof line there that I've got. Whoop, again, you know what? I can't be bothered. I cannot be bothered. Alright, let's plug you up, plug you up. You are fine. And let's get all this happening. Boom. Um, I might just leave the internal open. Just in case if I ever needed to go in here myself, I've sort of got something here I can sort of work with. Whether that might be a mistake, I have no idea, but you know, we'll see how that sort of pans out. Um, okay, this and this, and let's just plug you up, plugged, and I think that is inside, pretty much done except for the um, the garage door out there, which I was actually thinking about. Do I actually? Because um, I think you can actually make a garage door. Can you? Make, let's see. There we go. 
<coughs> excuse me. So, yeah, have a look at that. I don't know how big that door is, but I'm thinking I might do that. I don't know, if I move house, I guess. Because this has got look like a little garagey feel. Well, it is a garage. That's what it is. And then at least that way I can um, have that as like a little um, a little home, I guess. Or look, you know, for my for my rides, if and when I get better rides later on in game. But anyway, I'm sort of um, getting off topic, but I should be focusing on this and getting this all sealed up. But yeah, that's what I'm. That's probably my thought process um, with that. And we've got this. Oh, I, oh, I did. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. Ah, uh, okay. Twitchy hands. That's what it is. All right. So that's pretty much all plugged up. We're we're good to go. Um, what I want to do? I want to get a ladder. A couple of wooden ladders. Three will do. Let's just make four, just in case. Uh, that's going to take a while anyway. So the next thing I want to do is I'm going to start. I'm going to need cement. Okay. Yeah, so I can only, okay, so 1,200, okay. So I'm only going to have the ability to get up to, uh, what is this? Um, this is cobblestone. This is cobblestone now. So we have flagstone, we're up to cobblestone. So I'm going to need some cement, and I don't have cement. I've got a little bit, but I don't think I'll have enough to further strengthen all this, so... That's going to serve a bit of a problem for me. Oop. Cool, cool. And fix you up. Very good, okay. Perfect. At least I'll sort of get it all consistent, I guess. And, you know, as much as I want it to be more, you know, I guess durable. I think for this first Horde Knight, I think I should be okay with this. Plus I've got some ammo and I've got some weapons and things like that, so I should be okay. And plus what I'm thinking about doing as well with that, um, what's that? Oh no, that's just a sign, that's fine. Uh, let's get rid of that, make that good, beautiful, and fix all this up. And we are good there. Yeah, so as you can see, they really actually um, made a bit of a mess of things going through here, but so I wasn't really um, prepared for that. So basically I was just cutting out all the edges around here, just so I can get my uh, my wood rails, you know, laid down, because you, can, you couldn't actually do that. And if I really wanted to, I probably should have just sort of built it out from here, and just sort of, you know, done it that way and just sort of came out, but I don't know. I sort of wanted to just have it all open, just so I can... Um, I've got more visibility but just direct, uh, direct, uh, directly below me. Uh, English is a little bit harder today. So yeah, that's pretty much where I'm at with things. Just sort of trying to um, get all that, all this uh, base improved. But we are 10 a.m. So I think we're doing okay in terms of oh, um, getting the base prepared. So just making sure that I've got everything in tip top shape. Just so, you know, if I do fall over, it'll take a little bit longer for that to happen, so. <laughs> oh my goodness. But Horde Day, this is this is the fun part. This is what we've always, um, you know, it's what everyone wants to see. This item needs repairs. Let's just go ahead and repair him. Ah. <coughs> okay, I'm going to have to wait for that. It's 34 seconds, so it's not too bad. While I'm doing that, uh, or waiting, I guess, I may as well just quickly run back home use this time effectively and um, let's see if I do have a maybe cement or concrete or whatever I think it was cement that I needed um, and I might be able to start improving that side I don't think I'll have enough for it that's the problem um, bum, 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 bum. I actually have nothing yeah okay uh, well pff, very little yeah that's not gonna do anything whatsoever so yeah so cobblestone um, rocks it's going to be and just the upgrade one over so yeah um, okay beautiful it's good let's just keep pumping this out and we're going to need to make more spikes uh, do, 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 do. spikes 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 
Oops. Because, like I said, 39 is not going to be enough at all. None whatsoever. So, yeah. And to be honest, I don't know if I'm going to be able to have the ability to actually um, secure or drop spikes down right across the base. So, yeah, I don't know how that's going to all come down to. But anyway. You know what, I may as well do this and just get... Oh, what am I doing? Ah. Yeah, may as well just do this consistent, make it all consistent. And yeah, cement, cement's going to be a... Um, it's going to be something I'm going to need to focus on and get. I think actually the trader has a cement mixer, so I should be able to utilize that and take advantage of that. So that might have to come in a, at a later stage. But right now, it looks like we're looking good. Um, okay, so we're over here now, and let's just get all this happening. And get this all done. Bom, bom, bom. Let me know if you guys are interested in just me doing this mindlessly. Um, well, not, I wouldn't say mindlessly, but, you know, does base building interest you guys at all? Like, for me, I, I love when, pe when people do base building videos, because I, I really enjoy what people sort of come up with. And yes, this is not, you know, the most, um, you know, uh, advanced type of base, but it's something that, you know, you guys can sort of watch and, you know, uh, enjoy. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. And I did see something else around here. No, oh, there you are. So they actually got pretty high up, which is really, really annoying. Um, do you guys need, require any maintenance? I don't think you do. You guys are, oh, yes, you guys over here, boom, boom, boom. Yeah, so what I'm thinking, at the very least, um, oh, I'm out of cobblestone. Are you serious? Damn. Yeah, not good. Okay, so, <laughs> I didn't think I was actually going to run out, to be honest with you. I went through over 500 cobblestone. Yeah, okay. And I'm, what, 60% done? 70% done? Alright, so I'm going to have to quickly mine out a few things, get some uh, clay happening because I know I don't have any clay, and basically I've just been over here, uh, where is my shovel, it is over here, so shovel wise, yeah, basically I'm just sort of fashioning up whatever I can here and just sort of grab as much as I can. I thought I actually did enough to be honest with you and now that, that I haven't, I'm going to need to make the necessary improvements. So what I'm thinking is I'm just going to continue doing what I'm doing here and hopefully I'll, I'll get enough um, clay because I know I've got a bit of stone that I can sort of work with and hopefully that's going to be enough for me to get um, everything upgraded. Hopefully. I say that now but We'll see how that sort of pans out. I know I've got some blocks here, but I want to hang on to those as well. So I really don't want to sort of make any sort of misuse of any resources that I've got kind of thing. So I want to make sure that I am maximizing all of my opportunities here. Um, along with that, I am a little bit thirsty and hungry. So I'm going to do some uh, food. Uh, stamina and health. Let's just do that. Uh, you are a bit thirsty. Okay, so we're good. So this should keep us going for a little bit longer and I'll be able to uh, grab some of the stone that I've got upstairs and I should be fine with that. And hopefully by then I've got some more forge iron cooked away and we'll get those spikes laid down. Like I said, I don't have enough spikes. Um, I don't feel I have enough spikes, but I'm going to try and focus on... Uh, this, this is not good. So I'm going to try and focus on um, uh, pretty much uh, the frontal part of the base. So basically I'm going to make sure that I've got spikes all around the base, but more importantly I'm going to make sure that the zombies are going to attack the front. <coughs> and hopefully that sort of helps out because I've got the little perimeter of... Um, um, of that fencing around there. So hopefully that's going to work. I'm not too sure, but that's my theory for now. And if it works, great, because at least that way they're all going to come and try and get me from the front. Um, and I'll have more of an opportunity that way to sort of, you know, defend the base. And it, 
if that's the case, hopefully the other side of the base is um, you know unscathed and there's no um, or minimal impact. Hopefully, and with that being said, at least I can sort of work on the front base, and that's going to be you know hit the heaviest. But yeah, we'll see how that all goes, and hopefully that all sort of pans out in the interim. But for now. You know, we're just going to have, um, it's just going to be a waiting game. It's going to be, you know, will we survive? Um, you know, is the base going to stand up? I, I think it will. I mean, it's a pretty simple base. I mean, it's not like it hasn't been done before. It's been done before numerous times. But I think for a first base and for a first boss play, I think this is sort of like a safe mode feel. I really want to do something different, but I'm not too sure if I'm going to have the capacity to sort of get it all done. Um... I'm going to try it in my other world actually that I've been playing so I'm going to test it out that way and if it works, um, great, I'm going to sort of roll with that but if not, then um, we'll see how it sort of goes. Uh, is that plane? I went just there, let's see what's that on the map, it's just completely, oh, we're not that far away. Alright, I'll let you drop and I'll go and grab that airdrop. I actually got the initial airdrop um, off camera. And what had happened was it actually disappeared off my map as soon as I got in the area where I thought it was um, initially. I was able to, um, yeah, um, rescue it and... Ooh, I don't have any stones. Uh, yeah. So I was able to grab it and, um, yeah, happy days. Didn't get much out of it. It was mainly food, so I think it was pretty good anyway. So for a first, first drop, uh, first airdrop, it's probably what you wanted really at the end of the day. Grab that every little bit can help. Um, yeah, the cement, I, I need to find more cement, or make cement really, but I think my trader has it all, so that should be that, um, so let's go and do the cobblestone rocks, that's got to be enough, I'll be very surprised if it's not, um, let's go get, let's go get that airdrop, because why not? And we're just literally just around the corner. That'll give us enough time to uh, make sure everything's all cooked up as well. Um, and yeah, we just sort of continue going along and getting this all done because it's 12 p.m. now, midday, just beyond midday. So yeah, I don't know how this is going to pan out. I think I'll be coming down to the wire to be honest with you guys. So let's see how it all goes. Uh, where is this airdrop? Where did you go, airdrop? Uh, airdrop, airdrop, airdrop. Where are you? There you are. There you go nestled in where a tree is. Really? Really, that was a waste of time. Look at even use the stun baton, and that's not even. You know what? Even with the stun baton as it is, it's only worth twelve dollars. I'd rather just scrap it and sell the parts because you get more money believe it or not if you scrap it but yeah anyway that is how that story goes i guess but anyway what do you do all right so let's head back um i might just run back quickly back into my home base and grab my um yeah, iron that i've just cooked up <coughs> excuse me that i've just cooked up so oh, 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 oh. Stay on the right path. Here we go. Here we are. And let's see what I've got. Right. Constantly out of stamina. Story of my life with this. Alright, so let us grab. I've ran out of cooking. Not good, not good, not good. Uh, let's do it for another half an hour. That should be enough. Boom. Alright, so... I might just grab that for... Oh, you know what? It's only 9 left. 50 seconds. Um, so, I haven't actually made too much progression over here. So, this is only just a little bit. So, I started, sort of started getting this all capped off. What I was thinking is I wanted to sort of... Um, because I've got so much of a big space up here. I was thinking maybe getting a farm set up here. Just like a nice, decent, big farm. Have all the plots up here, and yeah, that would be pretty much what I'm sort of thinking. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see how that sort of plays out. But that's my thought process with it. And whatever else I need, I guess I can sort of, you know, pretty much 
um, fill out inside here. You know, I can put all my workstations here once I sort of get the need to, you know, utilize the workstations. And yeah, take it from there. That's probably where, um, you know, that might be a little bit on the more plausible side. Um, okay, so we've got the rest of that. Great, let's take that. Um, how are we doing with all of that? That's five seconds away. Thank God for that. We get all the rest of the cobblestone rocks sorted out. Um, we need spikes, don't we? Spike trap. And what? 11. That's what I can do. God. Yeah, like I said, there's only so much that I'm able to do here. And so little time. I don't know if I left this too late. I should have probably started getting the, um, at least the spikes ready. Or, or, you know, a lot earlier on. Things like upgrading all of this around um, the surroundings of the base here you know should be you know done with on the day you know there shouldn't be any issues that you shouldn't be able to do it you know not on the day kind of thing or beforehand or whatever but anyway um, let's see if I've got enough how much it's 10 10 per hit yikes okay didn't realize how um, how much it actually sort of take, um, yeah, how much it sort of, um, takes away in terms of repair costs. Um, okay, so what I'm thinking, maybe cross over here, and then I can sort of take my bike, oh, I don't know, because maybe, because I, I don't know how it's going to work, because at least I can sort of maybe make it a break for it over here jump on the bike and race back home or something like that. That might be the way to do it, I'm not too sure. So I might have it just here, maybe, I don't know. Um, gotta think, gotta think. Okay, let's just do it, why not? Get rid of that, get rid of that. Okay. Um, yeah, might just do it up here. One, two, three. Can I jump up? That should be fine. Honestly, that should be fine. And I'm going to have to go into uh, advanced. And I want my rails to sort of go a certain way. I think it's that way. I just sort of do it that way, along that way, along those lines. Sort of go along and build it out. I'm not going to focus too much on this side here because I doubt that I'm going to need it. It's just the minimum reach. So when the zombies are just here, basically I can sort of stand here and just either um, hit them with uh, any sort of arrows or just use the gun just to sort of get them, you know, uh, get them taken care of kind of thing. But more or less, I want to go sort of like two or three outwards out this way and at the front just so you guys can actually see what's going on. Uh, when it is obviously Horde Night and when it does happen and, you know, stuff hits the fan, basically. Um, okay, so here... And I'm going to have to sort of do a bit of manoeuvring. Okay. Oop, I just had it, I just had it, I just had it. Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. And basically, I'm just going to sort of build her out. That's pretty much it. Yeah, we're just going to sort of smash it out. Alrighty guys, so... Just went off camera a little bit and just try to get enough of the base done as soon as possible. And, um, yeah, we are getting very, very close. Um, I still need... All of these iron spikes down, which I haven't started yet. A few of these things that have just... Uh, it's just taken up my time today. It's really, absolutely crazy. What I've done here is, and I was just thinking about it beforehand, that I might just um, maybe not protect this much of the base, probably, I don't know, um, just ever so a little bit, so like as in, um, I, I want to focus on the front, and I want the, the zombies to come out on the front, but I thought I'd make this area here sort of like a... Um, I could over, overhang over here, so I should be able to be okay and run around on that side, and hopefully that might confuse the zombies. So if they ever get to that side, I can sort of get on that side there, and I can still hurt them. And I think that's what my thought process with that is. Um, I don't want this, I want this, this way, cool. So we're just going to quickly put all these down. I've only got a couple of game time hours before this happens. 
Um, oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Um, like I said, I don't think I'm going to have enough to secure the base, but I'm going to get enough just for the front part here, and I just want to sort of get this happening. Oop, no, no. Uh, there we go. And... Because I think I'm going to have run out actually because I'm down to four which is not good and I think I'm just going to go about there I really did not have enough and I didn't have enough time to do all this and this is not good at all rots whatsoever uh, where's the ghost come on ghost come on come on come on Oop, there we go cool and oh no no no, no. I just had you fall bang all right boom 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 Boom, 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 boom. Okay. And yes. Oh no no. I literally just had you. Literally just had you. Okay, boom. Uh hang on. Ah. Uh, I don't even know what I'm looking at right now. It's getting way too dark and I think you guys are not going to be happy with that so give me one sec I'm gonna up the gamma on this yes I know this is not the right way of doing things but for the sake of the you guys I might as well do it and that's it that's pretty much where it's going to be um right where am I up to I've got wow I'm down to my final 10 and I'm not going to have enough. No, I am not. I can't believe I ran out of this. Okay, so yeah, this is pretty much going to be it. I'm going to pretty much finish this off here. And that's it. I literally had just that little bit there. I sh probably should have done, yeah, probably should have done better with that. Um, I've still got spikes coming through, yes. Um, but still, it's not going to be enough. I've ran out of um, iron as well, so I'm literally at the limit here with all this. So if I'm lucky, I might be able to get maybe half of this up uh, finished up here, and then that's pretty much it. And I'm going to have to sort of start getting ready for Horde Night. Um, <coughs> pretty much, that's it. Um, I might as well get some arrows set up as well, because, yeah, why not? Um... I need some more wood, wow. Yeah, so I'm going to have to run and get some wood. But otherwise, guys, that's pretty much going to go ahead and leave it here. Next time you see me, it's going to be Horde Night, and we're going to have some zombies. So, appreciate you guys stopping by, as always. So, please like and share the video. That will really help me out immensely to get the um, video out there. And for a lot of other people to see the video, not just um, uh, people that just sort of stumble upon it or anything like that, or subscribe. So, I still would love for that to happen. If you guys can do that for me, that would be amazing. Um, but that's it, I'm done. Um, I'll see you guys for dark.